the Joe Rogan experience. So they want to build affordable housing, like in your community? It's a problem. Dave, people are saying like, you forgot your roots. Like, why wouldn't you want to support uh, affordable housing? Let me tell you something, Joe. First of all, I do not come from public housing. All right, just because I'm black does not mean I come from poverty. Second of all, I live in Yellow Springs. This affordable housing, it's not for brothers. It's for whites. If there's one thing I hate more than whites, it's poor whites. I hate white people, but I especially hate poor white people. It's a problem. Where more affordable housing could be built in the future. But Chappelle squashed that after threatening to pull his business ventures from the town if it went through with the plan. Here's Chappelle at the council meeting. No. Can you hear me? Yes. yes. Hi, I'm Dave Chappelle. <laughs> I just want to say, and Marianne, I could talk to you about this privately. Um, I don't know why the village council would be afraid of litigation from a $24 million a year company while they ix out a $65 million a year company. I cannot believe you would make me audition for you. You look like clowns. I am not bluffing. I will take it all off the table. That's all. Thank you. Okay. All right. It's a problem. Um, all right. I'm going to take one more comment from uh i see dave is on all right dave go ahead can you hear me, can you hear me? i can you're echoing but yeah oh, sorry about that. yeah sorry about that um i just want to say i'm uh, adamantly opposed to it obviously i live behind the development or the proposed development uh i do have many business interests in town i've invested millions of dollars in town, if you push this thing through, what I'm investing in is no longer applicable. And I would say that Oberg can come and buy all this property from me if they want to be your benefactor, because I will no longer want Can you hear me? Uh, we, you dropped for a minute there, Dave. The average age in the village is 49 years old. Without a school, you will not attract young families, and this city will not live beyond the retirees that decide to settle here. And I'm surprised that Marianne McQueen is is suddenly uh, not averse to change because you always are when I uh, 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 propose a change. And now all of a sudden we have to recognize the change. These changes are inevitable, but we do have a decision on what they will or could be. And I think we should use more of a visionary eye, uh, eye instead of a reactionary one because the potential of this place is immense and over is not the only solution. Thank you. All right. Thank you, Dave. I like to yield the rest of my time to Max Crum. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, we're all going to yield uh, all I'm our totally time joking. to Max I'm totally Crum joking. for, uh... <laughs> I know. But for real, over if you um, want to buy right. this stuff, come get it. All right. <laughs> uh, hey, so again, I do think this was a good discussion. Um, I think 